I've spent 85% of my life waiting for Sharon Brows. I thought there were going to be bagels. No, no, no. Tell Barack to come to Tuesday, but definitely not Thursday. And no, no Kanye. For sure not. Okay, thanks so much. Bye. Hey, guys. Sorry I'm late. Hey, Brows. All right, so what's on the agenda? So I've been telling Jeff that it's a party with a purpose. Fun, laughter, comedy. So much serious. Enough already with the serious. God knows we need a laugh. Fair enough. I'm not funny. God knows, Marty's not funny. You know, Marty's all about the seriousness. She's for social justice. It's minion static. It's all day long, that's all I hear. So I'm with Marty. It's a party with a purpose. That's what Marty would want, purpose. Jeff, you're right. You're not funny. And the world's not funny right now. I mean, things are falling apart. Look what's happening in this country. And I think this is a purpose-driven community. And this is we have to reflect that in everything we do. And also, you're not wrong, Melissa. I mean, look, this is, this is about holding joy and grief at the same time. I think this is an Elu Elu Divrei Elohim Chaim Hem moment. These and these are the words of the living God. How does that sit with you, Jeff Aroff? I, I think you're both right. It's a party with a purpose. Do you have any bagels? Bagels? All right, I think we have some leftover tofu in the break room, let's go. God, I hate tofu. Come on, can't we just do a sweet video about how awesome Marty is? When the idea of honoring Marty came up, there was just overwhelming, enthusiastic, and absolutely unanimous agreement by every single person, except Marty, who of course, doesn't want to be honored, but just wants to continue to do her work and do the incredible work that she does all the time for Icar. Hey, do you think we can include this in the interview? It's kind of, it's kind of loud. It's kind of big. What do you think? Mm -mm. Please? This past year, Marty was a leader in our work to become a 100% voting congregation. Marty led in that effort, starting from the smallest details, like what was the logo going to be? And how were we going to design it? And how would we roll it out to the community? And again, we made phone calls. We had a phone bank where dozens of Ikarites signed up and we called every member of the community and asked them to make a commitment to vote. And this last year, in 20, the 2018 election, we were a 99% voting community. And I am tremendously proud of that work as Minyan Sedek and of Marty and her vision as a leader to help us make that happen. And I know that that work, that voting engagement work, is something that Marty and Jeff have really put years and decades of their life into supporting. And to see it come to fruition in our community is a real testament to Marty's leadership in that work. Do, do, is this a toilet cleaner? What, what is this? We're going to do this in the bathroom? Well, it's the only free room. There's no, everyone's working oh, right now and there's did, a window. Did, did Sharon do it in here? No, she did it in her office. Okay. Do you have an office here? No. <sighs> Marty's amazing. Uh, I'll tell you what I, I'll tell you about Marty. Like everybody knows that she's an amazing social justice warrior, right? She marshals the troops, but nobody knows how she does it. Like the secret sauce, it's that no one can say no to her. You know, she has those big, brown, vivid eyes and that sweet smile and that dulcet voice and try to say no to her. Have you tried? Marty is a quiet hero. She never wants to take credit. She doesn't want to be honored tonight or any Shabbos morning with an Aliyah. But she is quietly working to transform our community and our city and the world. And the work she's doing is having an impact. She's building relationships. She's thinking strategically about what needs to change and what we can do about it. And most importantly, she's really driven by the core values that drive our community. So she's doing it in a way that feels like Ikar. It feels like the best of who we want to be in the world. Bagels.